Silent Power specializes in energy storage, in particular working with utilities you know, to store excess renewable solar and wind during the off-peak hours for use during the critical uh, time during the day. And we solve two problems. We make uh, renewable energy more usable mm -hmm. by making it available when the grid needs it the most. We help utilities manage peak demand by decreasing it in homes and businesses when it's the greatest, for example, during hot days. This is our, our first flagship product, the uh, on-demand energy appliance. This would go in your home or business. It would be placed next to your main service panel, wherever that may be. And this can be charged from a number of sources. There's batteries in here. For example, these ones sitting on the floor next to me. But the system would be charged either from solar or wind attached directly to the device or from the grid itself you know, during the off-peak when energy is the cheapest and it would release the energy during the day. You know, helping the homeowner both reduce their energy bill and the utility um, add, adding capacity to their system during the peak part of the day. I mean, to give two superpowers, you know, one, you know, being able to lift 500 pound batteries with, with great ease. Uh, secondly, both my power and our, our company's power, again, is working with utilities to help make renewable energy more, more effective. My kryptonite is, you know, dead batteries or perhaps a power outage. Those uh, scare us here at Silent Power. But, uh, you know, on a more serious note, we're an early stage company raising money or capital, you know, to grow our business in a down economy is certainly one form of kryptonite. Yeah, Minnesota is a great place, you know, to grow up an early stage company. Great mix of, of talent, both on the engineering and sales and marketing side. You know, the state's been very supportive, you know, from, you know, everything from grants, you know, to other incentives, you know, to encourage us to stay in this area. Yeah, just stick with it. I mean, this is in, in the early phases of a very large industry. And, uh, you know, persistence is going to be the, the greatest attribute for people who succeed. Thank you.